the animals we raise for food produce huge amounts of manure. In fact, these uh, industrial animal factories that are primarily used to raise animals for food in the developed world need to store these feces in huge acres and acres of cesspool, which they euphemistically call lagoons. And these, of course, befoul the air around them, but also release large amounts of methane and also huge amounts of nitrous oxide. These are released not just from the uh, lagoons themselves, but also when these feces are spread over the huge amounts of cropland that must be used to raise plants to feed the animals. Nitrous oxide is about 300 times more powerful than carbon dioxide. When it comes to methane, about 37% of the world's methane emissions come from animal agriculture. And about 70% of the world's nitrous oxide emissions come from animal agriculture. These gases, which are produced in smaller quantities than carbon dioxide but are far more powerful, have a huge effect. And because their power, and because they come mostly from animal agriculture, it makes this sector of the economy important to target in any effort to address this serious global crisis.